Okay, what I'd like to do is take a few minutes now and look at the difference between point slope form and the slope intercept form. Because you're going to see this in the next few slides, right? What's point slope form and slope intercept form? And this one's the one that's way more common, y equals mx plus b. This is the one that you see that you're likely taught in high school. Um, but this is another one. Both of these require you to know a point and a slope, right? So I'm going to do the exact same question with two of them just to see what it's asking. I've chosen a slope of 3 and a point of 2, 5. Nothing too exciting. Remember, x is 2, y is 5 when we're doing this, right? So if you're asked to find the equation, okay, given the slope and a point using slope, a uh, point slope form, you would do it this way. If you're asked to find an equation using the slope intercept form, you'd do it this way. Uh, we're given the exact same information, so we better get the exact same equations in the answer. Let's have a look. Right? So I know the slope, which we generally use m for, for slope, is going to be 3. So I have to put 3 in for the m. I also know the point is 2, 5, and we're, this is x1 and y1. Okay? So x1 is 2 and y1 is 5. So here we go. y minus y1, which is 5. Okay. equals, well, the m, the slope, is 3, x minus x1, x1 is 2, okay. and you do that. Okay. Well, now, y minus 5, we need to use the distributive law, right? And remember the distributive law, we're going to uh, multiply this and multiply that in, right? Distributive law. 3 times x is 3x, three, 3 times minus 2 is minus 6, right? Now, what we want to do is get y by itself, okay? So, uh, to get y equals, well, we have a minus 5 here. We don't want it, so we're going to add 5 on this side. But then to maintain balance, remember the equal sign, you always have to maintain balance. We also have to add 5 on this side, okay? Some of you have seen it written out like this very, um, very, very formally. There's no real expectation that you do that. It just takes some, some extra time. So this is an unnecessary line, but a line you could put in if you're doing a long form. Okay. Anyway, the net result is we get y on this side. And on this side, we get 3x. And minus 6 plus 5 is minus 1. So we can say y equals 3x minus 1 is the equation that would go through of a line going through this point with this slope. Now, the other way that was done, and the way that's very common, is, well, we know that m is 3, so a lot of people put y equals 3x plus b, okay? Now, b, if you think back to your high school days, b is what we call the uh, y-intercept, okay? But if we don't know the y-intercept, it doesn't really help us with this format. So then what we do is we know this point is 2 and 5, and it gets put directly in to the x and y, right? So the, the y is 5, right? Same thing, x1, y1. So the y is 5, so we put a 5 in here, okay? And 3 times a 2 in there, and plus b, right? So now what we have is this b, right? And what we do is we say, well, hold on, this is 5 equals 6 plus b. I want to uh, have the b by itself, so I'm going to subtract 6 on both sides. Why would I do that? Well, 6 minus 6 is 0, so 5 minus 6 is going to be my b, and negative 1 is going to equal b, right? So when I do it with this technique of putting the, uh, the 0.25 directly into x and y, what I end up getting is the b, right? So now what I have is I have the slope, and I have the b, and then I just have to put it together and say, therefore, y equals, slope is 3x plus b, but b is negative 1, so you put negative 1, okay? And, of course, the answers are the same. Just two different ways of getting to the exact same answer uh, using point-slope form or using the slope-intercept form. Okay? 
One last thing I'd like to say about that is if one of these is negative, you have to be careful where your negatives flow inside the brackets, right? Because I'd be if I'm subtracting a negative, that would create a positive scenario. So if these are negative, you have to be a little bit careful about that. Okay, all right.